Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the shop. My name is Brian, and for once, for a channel called Into the Woodshop, I'm actually doing some woodworking today. It's going to be a pretty simple project. Uh, this is just a test piece. Basically what I'm doing, take a piece of wood, putting a bottle opener on it, and I'm going to put a magnet in the back so that when you open a bottle, the magnet falls down and gets stuck on the magnet, and you get a big cluster of, mag of bottle caps here. I've seen them online, they look pretty cool. I'll be making this as, as some gifts for the holiday season. Should turn out pretty cool. Thought I'd film it, since I was gonna build it anyway. And I'll engrave something on it with the laser afterwards. For this project, I have this piece of mahogany board that was left over from a previous project. So free material. It's a pretty nice piece. I actually got it for way cheaper than I should have. Nice piece of three quarter mahogany. Let's cut it up. Okay, so we've got the mahogany cut out now. You can see that? That'll go right there. But just to make it look a little more interesting, I'm gonna run it through the router, put a little rounded step into it. Okay, so I need to put a magnet right here in the back, got it all sanded, and got the edges routed. So I need to put the magnet in here, just got a Forstner bit in the drill press, and I made this little jig since I have to make a bunch of these. Okay, so now I need to put a little mount on here, so I made this jig to use this router bit with. It's called a key router bit. Basically it makes a little undercut so I can put a screw in. So I made this little jig. This just slides in here. It's kind of hard to do with one hand. There we go. Slides in. Router bit goes down, slots over, comes back and back up. I'll show you what it looks like. There we go, nice little slot for a screw. So I just engraved the, the service on my Glowforge. By the way, like in description, you get up to $500 off. It's a pretty good deal. It turned out pretty good. I'm not going to try and explain the engraving. It's an inside joke, so just got to finish it now and put the little ball stopper on and stick a magnet in the back. So I didn't get video, but I've now put linseed oil on this and pre-drilled the holes for this. It's looking a lot better. And unfortunately, I cannot use the black screws it came with because they're too long, so I, I had to go with silver ones. Let's screw them in. Okay, that's in. I just need the magnet. Put a little super glue in the hole. I got these magnets here. Got two of them just so it's strong enough. Drops right in the hole. So I hope you enjoyed this little project. Turned out really well. Made a bunch of these. I don't have a bottle that needs opening at the moment. I'll insert a video of that, of them working. So basically you pop the bottle, cap falls down, gets stuck right here. They all kind of collect. You can get a bunch to fit. I'm just gonna use screws because that's what I have. They collect and then when you're done, you can grab it. And then it's just a nice decoration. So I hope you enjoyed that video. It was pretty fun to make. Quick little woodworking project. 
Uh, if you want to see more stuff, you can subscribe, like the video if you thought it was good. It helps push it to more audience. It lets me do bigger projects. You can follow me on Instagram at Into the Woodshop for more behind the scenes updates, cool things coming up. So if you want to make one of these yourself, I'll put a link in the description to all the parts I use for this if you're interested in making one. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.